FIDIC stands for International Federation of Consulting Engineers and it is among the most widely used standard forms of contract in the construction and engineering industries worldwide. Established in 1913, FIDIC was founded by national associations of consulting engineers from Belgium, France and Switzerland. The organisation's primary aim was to standardise consulting engineering practices and provide a forum for collaboration. Over the years, FIDIC has played a pivotal role in developing model forms of contracts to facilitate international construction projects, especially those involving parties from different legal, linguistic and cultural backgrounds. The first FIDIC contract, the Red Book, was published in 1957 and intended for civil engineering works where the design responsibility primarily rested with the employer. It was modelled after the UK's ICE conditions of contract but adapted for international use. The Red Book quickly became a benchmark for international projects, renowned for its balanced allocation of risks between employers and contractors. In 1963, FIDIC released the Yellow Book, specifically tailored for mechanical and electrical works. Unlike the Red Book, the Yellow Book catered to projects where contractors typically bore design responsibilities. This marked a significant shift in addressing the varied needs of construction procurement and contract management. Throughout the 20th century, FIDIC contracts expanded their scope to accommodate the complexities of modern infrastructure projects. In 1987, the Orange Book was introduced for design build and turnkey projects. This was an early acknowledgement of the growing demand for contractor-led procurement methods, where the contractor undertakes both design and construction responsibilities under a single contract. A major milestone in the evolution of FIDIC contracts came in 1999 with the release of the Rainbow Suite, which included updated versions of the Red and Yellow Book and a new Silver Book. The Silver Book was designed for engineering, procurement and construction and turnkey contracts, transferring more risk to the contractor to provide greater price certainty for employers. This suite also introduced a standardised approach to dispute resolution through dispute adjudication boards reflecting the growing emphasis on efficient conflict management in international projects. FIDIC continued its efforts to refine its contracts, releasing the second edition of the Rainbow Suite in 2017. These updates address criticisms of earlier editions, such as lack of clarity and complexity, and it incorporated modern principles such as risk management, dispute avoidance and collaborative approaches. Today, FIDIC contracts are globally recognised as industry standards for fairness and adaptability, used extensively in projects funded by international financial institutions like the World Bank and the Asian Development Bank. Their widespread adoption is attributed to their ability to balance risk allocation, foster transparency and accommodate the diverse needs of global stakeholders. From its inception in 1913 to its current status as a leader in standard form contracts, FIDIC has continually adapted to the changing demands of the construction and engineering sectors, cementing its reputation as a cornerstone of international project delivery. Matrone, a commercial hub for your business.